Hi guys, uh, this video is on uh, NVIDIA graphics driver update error. I had this problem a couple of days back. So while uh, browsing for a solution, uh, I came across uh, several posts wherein I felt that uh, there are several others uh, who also faced uh, the same uh, problem at one point of time or the other. So luckily I was able to find the solution and hence I thought I should share with you guys. Uh, just in case it might be uh, helpful so the error is uh, basically even though you, if you have the latest version of the NVIDIA GeForce graphics driver uh, still the NVIDIA would prompt you for uh, updation so if you see here uh, it is prompting me to update my uh, driver to 376.09 uh, but if you see uh, I have got this uh, driver already installed here this is the list of the programs which I have installed and in here you can see that I have installed the NVIDIA graphics driver uh, 376.09 so the reason for this error is uh, it is detecting the NVIDIA gra graphics card but it is not able to verify the state of the card you can verify the stuff what I say from going into the uh, device manager right click on the NVIDIA GeForce choose details and uh, in here go down to is connected or is present is true so even if you check uh, is present it is true and it is connected and it is present so it is the system is able to see that there is a graphics card but it is not able to verify the status of it if you go and check uh, click on the status it's, it says dn has problem uh, dn underscore is a disableable which means and another uh, software is conflicting the uh, your graphics driver so another uh, graphics related software or application or whatever you might have installed say uh, i found the software uh, like all those softwares uh, which uh, enabled you to mirror your screen or uh, all those display stuff uh, conflicting the uh, graphics driver and one more way to verify the problem is uh, run spiky it says that uh, SLI has been uh, disabled and uh, even in here you can you can verify that I have installed the 376.09 so if you see uh, the main reason for this conflict is another software related to the graphics say something more of uh, uh, say something like uh, screen sharing screen mirroring or uh, remote desktop access or remote desktop control or check for those kinds of applications uh, which you installed Go to the uh, NVIDIA Corporation and uh, Control Panel Client. Double click on uh, NVGPUUtilization.exe. This will open up a chart uh, which gives you the GPU utilization. Uh, you can see here that uh, it is not detecting any uh, graphics card. So, based on my uh, findings, uh, I is that uh, the mirror of uh, software is the one uh, which is conflicting the uh, graphics driver so I choose to uninstall it and uh, after uninstallation of the uh, mirror op and mirroring related softwares the graphics was working absolutely fine so use something like a revo uninstaller and uninstall the software select all delete all the dependencies and after that uh, I found another application uh, the VDD2 associated with the mirror up uh, also to be uh, a cost
all these uh, uninstallation will take effect only after you uh, restart your system and so i'll just proceed to restart the system and, uh, let me just show you as to uh, as to how it has panned out hi so now i have uh, restarted my system and first let me open the gpu utilization and so if you see here uh, the gpu has been detected uh, previously if you can remember uh, there was nothing here now it says geforce uh, 820m 0% and similarly if i open the device manager and go and go into properties details status it says uh, driver loaded started it is disableable enumerator uh, nt driver it says it has started and uh, it is driver has loaded and another thing uh, another place where you can check uh, verify is uh, here you, you you don't see any uh, update notifications here and once you open uh, nvidia geforce experience panel and uh, in the drive uh, in the driver section under geforce experience if i check for the updates it, not, it says that i have the latest uh, geforce driver so that is pretty much it guys i hope you found this insightful and helpful so thank you